But that's not the same with everyone. German car parts supplier Continental has temporarily resumed tire manufacturing for passenger cars at its Russian plant in the same city of Kaluga. It is to protect local workers who could otherwise face criminal charges. Continental said move was aimed at meeting local demand and in line with sanctions imposed on Moscow for its invasion of Ukraine, which Russia calls a special military operation. Continental, which on March 8th said manufacturing at plant had been suspended, did not elaborate on potential charges staff might face. Continental said resumption in manufacturing was not a profit-driven decision. Finland's Nokia, Nokian ties, in fact, warned that EU sanctions will make it hard to sell ties in Russia. Although in March it said the decision to hold on to its factories gave it control over where the tires are sold. Around half of raw material used to produce tires in Russia came from outside country. Italy's Pirelli has halted investments in Russia and curtailed its plants there. Pirelli makes around 10% of global tire output in two Russian factories. President Putin of Russia said in March Russia could seize assets of companies that abandoned their operations there. In fact, Russian prosecutors have also warned that some Western countries and their employees could face arrest if they shut manufacturing of essential goods. We on now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.